In this tutorial, we're going to discuss about genotype by yield traits by plot using our software. As usual, you have to use the Metan package. So submit this to our studio. And if you remember in the previous tutorial, we tried to discuss about genotype times uh, trait by plot. But today we will add the yield uh, component or the yield part in our model. And for this tutorial, we're going to use the data underscore G. So in order to see that, type view and submit to our studio. Then you can see your data structure or your data frame in this way. And the genotype by yield time straight by plot approach helps to tackle the problem when you are carrying out the genotype evaluation on multiple trade so that in order to carry out the genotype by yield times trade um, uh, by plot you have to use a function gytv then under the parenthesis in the first you have to indicate your data name then it is followed by the genotype and again it's followed by cw cw here is means uh the response the sorry the green yield so i select just uh, simply randomly from this by considering CW as a yield. But for real, if it is, uh, for example, NR is yield, so you have to select NR as your yield. But I, by default, or sorry, by uh, I select randomly the CW, or maybe I can select ED, or I can select EL or AB. So on the basis of your true data, you have to select the uh, the yield part so in this section you have to indicate what only the the green yield so here is the function then the data then here is the genotype then the green yield so assume that CW as what as a green yield so type this and feed to our software then we will see uh, the uh, by plots one by one the first one is a basic plot, so as usual you have to use a mod. Mod means what we created here, so that the type is equal to 1, that means it's a basic plot. Then the color of the genotype is blue, the color of the environment is red, which will be displayed in the red. And then the size of the genotype, uh, maybe 3 or 2, that is on the basis of your preference, so you have to do, you have to do in this way. So submit this to our studio then you will get genotype by yield times uh, trait uh, by plot in this way so continue for uh, the rest for example you can the difference between the previous tutorial and this tutorial is what there is addition of yield but all the concept all the interpretation are similar so in order to carry out the the average tester coordination view for the genotype times yield times trait so you have to use a type 2 then all things are the same and you will get your result in this way and again you can continue uh, to the type 3 that means uh, which one where so type is equal to 3 then you will get the result in this way yes as you can see here there is yield there is a uh, one uh, C D E D means other trait and E P is other trait, E L is other trait, and the lines that are displayed here is are the genotypes. So the which one where view for what for the genotype times yield times trait by plot. So continue for the rest in this fashion since it is similar with uh, all the concepts are similar with the genotype times trait. For example, if you want to see the discriminative versus the representativeness, you have to type is equal to 4, so you can get the result in this way. Then again, you can if, if you want to examine the yield uh, times uh, the yield times uh, trait, again you have to when you type is equal to 5, so it's not working. So instead you have to use mod equal to select the environment. Then if you tap this, you uh, get the combination of the genotype, the yield, and the trait in this way. Then
Then again, if you want to rank the yield time, the trade combination, you have to type the color to six, so you will get the uh, result or the backlog in this form. Then again, you can continue in similar uh, way. So lastly, uh, lastly, let's see the relationship among the, gen uh, the yield and trade. So type this and submit to our studio. Then this is the buy plots. So someone asked uh, asked me a question about how to change this uh, background into white. That means from the gray to uh, white. So uh, in this way you can convert. In this three way you can uh, convert from the this is the methane term. So from the methane term into other term as it in the question. So you have to use a is my a, a means here is a plot that we created here is a so you have to use the term bw then you have to use all these uh, codes so that you can uh, get the result mm, sorry yeah i hope it's working yes so by this way you can change from the gray to white or alternatively you know yeah, alternatively we can do also a plus the term classic method yes yes let's see it or uh, a plus the term bw method in this way or the term um, method minimal in this way, yeah. So these are also the possible solutions for converting from the uh, grayscale to white scale. Then lastly, the term minimal. Yeah. Term minimal. So you can uh, use uh, from uh, all this uh, options you can use all these options so this is all about uh, today's uh, tutorial regarding to the uh, general type uh, by yield times uh, trade uh, by plot using our software and this is my uh, 100 uh, video so i'll be back after a month in other uh, form and in other tutorial until then uh, have a nice time and see you after and then